Hey YouTube, it's Adam from I'm a Music Mogul. Today's video, I'm going to show you how to make your own drum kit in Logic X. I know you download a lot of drum samples online, or you want to use those drum kits for my remake play packs. So here's how you import them and play them for your sessions and songs. We're going to be using Logic's EXS24 sampler instrument. Now there are alternatives like Ultrabeat, but this one is uh, fairly good and robust to use. Uh, so here are samples right here on the side. Now you could listen and preview your samples in your finder window, of course, but just because I want everything to fit on my screen, I have them here. So these are the samples from my Mask Off remake. We got a clap, a snare, a hat, and a kick. Now we're gonna go ahead and bring those into this sampler instrument right here so we can go ahead and play them out live. So let's go ahead and hit edit. And in this editor window, we can import these sounds. So let's go ahead and drag in our kick. You wanna choose what note you wanna bring it on. And for the most part, I like to start on C1. Now we've just imported this kick sample to C. And now I can play it by hitting the C on my keyboard. Let's go ahead and bring in our snare on C sharp. And as you can see, I'm playing those live just like that. We could also bring in multiple sounds at once as well. Let's go ahead and bring in my hat and our clap. We'll drag those in. You want to click this last option right here, continuous zone starting in the line key that the file was dropped on. And now we got our, our clap and our hat. All right, next thing that you want to do to go ahead and save this is just go instrument, save. I'm going to go ahead and call this a mask off kit. All right, now that we save that, let's go ahead and close this. And now we can actually play out those drum samples in our EXS24 instrument. Now I just want to take this a step further. If you guys want to use that MIDI that I always give you in the play packs, you want to bring that pattern into your songs and you didn't want to remake it yourself, the MIDI is very useful and that's why I do include them in the play packs and I'm going to show you why in a moment. Let's say this is our kick track. Actually, let's go ahead and duplicate this. This will be our snare track. Hi-hat, uh, kick, snare, hi-hat, and clap. So we're going to open up our MIDI pack from the Mask Off tutorial. And let's go ahead and drag in our hi-hats on our hi-hat track. Let's import the tempo. Uh, let's go ahead and bring in our kick track. Let's go ahead and bring in our snare track. And uh, what's left, left is our clap. All right, so this MIDI is very useful because now we could just use any sound that we want, but we're gonna be using the same sounds that we used in the remake. So the one thing that you gotta do though is find where your kick lives. So by chance, this kick actually is on the proper line. Let's see where the snare is. So that's hitting the clap and not the snare. So let's go ahead and select all of these MIDI information and bring it down to our snare. All right, here's our hi-hat. So that's playing the proper note. Let's see if the clap is playing properly. Just move that up to the clap. So that's how you use that MIDI to your advantage. Like this MIDI can be used in any songs, we use with any samples. You just all you have to do is locate where the sample is in your instrument and you got that pattern going in no time. So if I do that again, we'll bring in the hi-hat pattern too import and let's go ahead and bring in the kick pattern too just so you see how easy it is to use these midi samples in your sessions so you can create a library of midi and strum samples and you can use them in any sessions and get that workflow going very quickly now if you do have any questions on this you can ask me in the comment section below if you did want to see this mask off remake you can click the link in the top right hand corner I'm also going to go ahead and include this drum kit as a downloadable link in the description box below if you just want to get this drum kit. It's a fairly clean kick, clap, and hi-hat, and a snare that you can use in a lot of instances. So that's it for me guys. If you did like this video, remember to thumbs up and share it. And for more good videos like this one, remember to hit that subscribe button, and I'll talk to you all soon. Later. Peace.